Okay, let's learn how to play all the fuzz bass solos for Tighten Up by the Black Keys. We've seen a lot of really good videos on YouTube with um, all sorts of bass players demonstrating the easy bass line, you know, F sharp, A, B, C sharp. But what about the fuzz bass solos? Okay, so stick around, that's what we're going to do here. Alright, so here's bass solo number one. Okay, that was the intro bass solo when all the whistling's going on. Okay, so it goes like this F sharp in the ninth position on the A string. A string. Okay, you got that? Here's note number two the octave on the 11. 9, 11. Okay, so there's F sharp, F sharp, E, C sharp. Twelfth fret. Good. Okay, let me start over. Okay, we're gonna have four notes uh, in the first measure. Okay. All right. That was the first one. Okay. The second one is A. Here's the lick number two. A. Okay. So that was twelve, fourteen, twelve, fourteen, twelve. Okay. A, B, A, F sharp, A. Okay. And then we're gonna play the same lick but starting on a B. B, B, A, F sharp, A, okay, and then we're going to go up, the fourth measure is going to be C, C, I mean C sharp, C sharp rather, B, A, F sharp, I'm sorry, okay, so here's a slow mo. Okay, you got that? Okay, now, then they go into the, you know, the regular main body of this song. Okay, you, you probably have already picked that up. Okay, now, it goes into the, um, here's lead number one. Okay, it goes like this. F sharp. Okay, that's the first lick. Okay, I'm on the 11th fret and the 9th fret for all this. Okay, F sharp, C sharp, B. Okay, let me do it again. F sharp, F sharp, E, F sharp, E, C sharp, B. Good. Here's here's measure number two. Okay, let me play it again. There we go. That's better. C sharp, E, C sharp, B, A, F sharp, A. Okay, that was. I'm sorry. Okay, 11, 9, 11, 9. Wait, 11, 9, 11, 9. Wait, no. 11, 9. exciting bass solo. This one is um, a little bit more involved. Uh, again, it's, this is all just a F sharp minor or pentonic scale. Okay, good. So it goes like this. Uh, I'm going to start on the 11th fret. Sharp in the E. Okay. 
okay? And I'm going to move to the C sharp and the B on the 11 and the 9. Everything's on the 11th and the 9 and the G and the D, okay? Watch this. Okay, you got that? There's three of those, okay? And then you go like this. Okay, and that's measure four. Okay, that's going to go like this. C sharp, C sharp, A, B, A, F sharp, A. Okay, so that was 11, 11, 7, 9, 7, 9, 7. Okay, I end on the A string there. Good. Okay, and then, um, uh, and then you do this again. Okay, we move back. Uh, we play the first lick again in measure 5. Play it again, measure 6. Measure 7, they do something different. Okay, let me show you that one. I move up to the 11th position. Okay, so I'm using my first finger on the 11th fret of the G string, which is the note F sharp. Okay, good. I'm going to go F sharp. I use my pinky to play the 14th fret of the D string. E. Back to the F sharp. Up to the high A on the 14th fret. Good. I go back to the F sharp. And then I go back to the E on the 14th fret. So watch that again. And then he has this lick again. finger on the 11th fret of the D string, the C sharp. B, A, B, A, F sharp. Okay, so that's 11, 11, 9, 12, 9, 12, 9. Okay, and you get this. 